This podcast is sponsored by the Boy Scouts of America Northern Lights Council. Good things are happening with Cub Scouts, and now's the time to get your child involved. Registration is open now through October. Get the adventure started at nlcbsa.org. Storm Tracker Meteorologist Charles Picard with the Northland Outdoor forecast for this weekend, and it is a beautiful one. Mainly sunny skies with only a few showers moving on through. Through Friday night into Saturday, those clear skies stay, but by Saturday morning, that is where we see that chance of showers starting off in northern North Dakota and continuing to move east and southward as the day goes on. For most in South Dakota and southern Minnesota, we are getting away with sunny skies, while further to the north, near the North Shore and northern North Dakota, we're dealing with a few clouds, but either way, it is going to be warm throughout the day. By Saturday evening, those showers continue to move on through, and by Sunday morning, we have clear skies and sunny weather for much of the day. The wind is going to cooperate for much of the weekend, but Friday afternoon and evening, we still have that breeze making it out of eastern Minnesota and parts of Wisconsin, with it being gusty at points to around 15 to 25 miles per hour. But for most of the weekend, that is looking to be calmer, still a light breeze around 5 to 15 miles per hour for most of the region on Saturday, but still not too gusty. And that theme stays around for Sunday. Although by the end of the day, it does start to pick up in Western Dakotas with winds getting to around 10 to 20 miles per hour by Sunday afternoon and evening. With temperatures low, it is going to be rather nice and mild. Temperatures in Sioux Falls and South Dakota getting up into the 80s, while most of the region is still rather mild in the 70s. The one cooler spot is going to be across the North Shore, where Duluth and areas around there stay in the 50s, but still seeing that sun peak on through the clouds. By Sunday, it is rather similar, just more sun for more people. We have that sun shining on through much of the Dakotas, Minnesota, and Wisconsin as we saw before, and temperatures stay nice in the 60s, 70s, and 80s for much of the region.